At this point in time, everyone knows the drill. <laughs> no pun intended. Because it's a drill. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, that wasn't. Either way, as you guys know, Mr. Teapot Telephone Boy made another leaks video. And every time he makes a leaks video, this skeleton critiques it, gives you my thoughts, and tells you if it's actually good or not. I'm excited to see this. I've heard good things about the next drill event, so I think we have good things to look forward to. Also, if you're already subscribed for some reason, actually, what are, what are you doing? That makes no sense. But let's see if the telephone man cooked or didn't cook. At the end of the video, we'll, we'll decide. We'll be showing some leaks of the drill update part two units early. Why does it sound like he's talking into a microwave? Is that just me? And toilet tower fence. So like I've been saying, the drill update part two is going to be this Saturday. So literally- I'm surprised it's actually this Saturday. I didn't think it was going to. I haven't heard from Talantrix in a while. So it was making me a little bit nervous. But it is coming out tomorrow. Oh, that's tomorrow. Tomorrow. Really just the day after tomorrow, pretty much. Before I show anything though, like and subscribe. Blah, 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 Talantrix. You have 2.18 million subscribers. I think you're okay. You're okay. You'll be I am, all right. Because I want to hit two and a half million subscribers. That would be pretty cool. But anyways, this update, we're going, yeah. we're going to expand the drill event pass from four. Oh my God. No way. 30 tiers to 60 tiers. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. No, I'm actually excited. So right now, from all the tiers, 66,000 people have gotten to tier 20 and only 8,000 have gotten to tier 40. So Whoa. Yo, we're lacking on the drill event pass. Wait, where, where am I at? Hold on, I might barely have touched the drill event pass. Low-key, I did kind of forget about the drill event pass, but this update is sick, and it did bring a lot of players back to the player base. Yeah, I'm on tier 3. So, he said 60,000 people got to tier 20, and there's consistently, like, around 40-ish thousand plus people playing. Should we be concerned? Is there still a major body wager going on? Inspector Hopeless is on the case. But most people still have not gotten that far yet. Me. So the tier 60 drill guy is gonna be pretty rare. Now we're also going to be adding the drill hard mode. So Yay! Yay! That's actually what the skeleton's the most excited about. Drill hard mode is going to give 150 drills or 100 drills. How much does the easy mode give? Is it only 50? So with the double XP and double event boost, you'll get a good amount of drill. Yeah, you'll get a you'll get a good amount of stuff. We are deciding that right now because it is gonna be 60 waves. Wait, no, no. Okay. 60 wave. Okay, so it's gonna be like an abysmal mode. Okay, it's gonna be 50 waves. I'm okay, he changed his mind. It's like a nightmare mode. I actually like it more that it, it's gonna be 50 waves because I I'm gonna predict. I think this is what he's gonna say. I'm pretty confident that Telentric Teapot Telephone Pool Boy is gonna say. Actually, we're gonna be doing a part three drill event update next Saturday, and inside of that update, we're gonna add the abysmal drill world, and then in that, and then and then we can do like 60 waves. Just a prediction. A skeleton prediction. I don't know why I said 60. It's gonna be 50 waves, so... It's because you know you're... It's because you know it's coming out. So it's gonna be almost double the length of easy. So if we make it 100, then it is going to be still a bit faster because right now you can only skip every 20 seconds. So 30 waves at 20 seconds. We're doing math. This isn't my strong suit, guys. Here, maybe click off the video is 600 seconds so right now you can farm drill mode easy for 10 minutes per wave or 10 ah, it's hurting my head minutes per match then that goes up to about 16 and a half minutes for 50 waves but Uh, that'll be a hundred drills for 16 and a half minutes instead of 50 for 10 minutes The deciding factor was gonna be how many of the new ultimate exists and right now Uh, okay, hold on. Let's read this text box. So we can't confirm Talantrix teapot telephone pole boy does use the amount that exists of something Dragon Ball Z power scaling the less of you that exists the higher power you have and that kind of dictates a lot of its updates We've learned this but it says right here if it was too rare Rare, hard mode would give a bit more drill so that around two to three K exists. But right now it's on track to there, so hard mode will give a hundred drills. That isn't I it, okay, he just wants two to three thousand to exist. Got it. 521 exist after almost a week. So even if that keeps up another week and there will be 1,000 of the drill event lasts a whole month, that'll be 2,500. And if it lasts even two months, that'll- Okay, I totally wasn't listening. I if, I don't know if you guys were looking at me. I was just, I was blinking and opening and closing my- I'm gonna, okay. Be 5,000 at the most. So honestly, since it is slowing down, I'm thinking around 2,000 to 3,000 of upgraded titan drill dragons will exist like i just don't understand why i care 
And I don't know why you guys would care either. I think this is a pointless part of the video. This could have been skipped. This could have been left out. This, this skeleton, he doesn't, he doesn't care. Because it's going to speed up again this week from the update when we release hard drill mode at 100 drills per wave. But if we're still really far from that two to 3,000 exists after a few weeks, like if we're only at maybe 1,000 exists after another... He's still talking about how many exist. Their week of drill hard mode coming out, then we might up drill hard mode from 100 to 150. It's gonna be a just do it to 150 anyways. Like just do it. like I don't know why you wouldn't. Like okay, every one of you watching right now, if you had the choice between getting 100 drills or 150 drills by beating hard mode, what would you say? Every every one of you just said 150. I just said 150. Why would you not want more? If it's 150, that means you would get 300 drills if you had double event boost on, which would mean every 16 minutes or so you would be able to get one no yeah you'd get one ultra drill crate so in about a little less or a little bit more than an hour you'd be able to open four crates which would make it so that you get the assassin drill man a lot more easier however how however like he was saying only 562 of these exist which i'm, I'm about to make one more exist hold on watch this <laughs> Oh, and give me that drill, boy. Thank you very much. I'll just take that off your hands and make hard mode 150. He's going to make an abysmal mode. We we are, we are already know that. We don't. We actually, we don't know that. I'm just guessing. And I'm telling you that's what's going to happen. 100 this update, though. And it will also be 250 XP. So it will be double the drills, but two and a half times the XP. So it's going to... How much of you guys actually care about XP, though? be great for the drill event pass anyways let me show you guys some of the units i probably should tell you guys how we're gonna oh good amount of you care about experience i'm sorry i was thinking clan xp i thought that's what he meant the crate though so you get the crate just by winning easy mode you're gonna get one crate and then you get two crates for winning hard mode the new drill crate not the one already in the shop because there's gonna be a new drill crate that has some hey okay sickums okay so it, this so far is very similar to that of the clock event so inside of the clock event at two different points in time, there is two different crates that were released. There was the time crate, and then there was also the future crate. Which, in my opinion, I didn't hate. It was actually pretty cool, and it added to the past of the time. It's what the game needed, like I said, at that moment in time. And I think it makes sense for the game to have something like this right now. And it keeps players playing in the game, and it keeps people, you know interested and it keeps the game relevant just like we like so why would we not like this i think it's good some drill booster units and they are going to be three units in that crate here's one the corporal drill man he's <laughs> dude he looks like sergeant bones he's a military themed drill unit and this guy is only going to do boosting now drill i like that drill booster units are unique because they only boost drill units well uh, hmm before i make my decision what is he gonna say they can boost other units, but they boost drill. They can only boost drill units. However, they can also boost other units. Which one is it? Make up, make up your mind. Drill units at a much higher rate. So they're not going to be too. Okay, I like that a lot. I like it. I like that a lot, actually. I'll be honest. Good for boosting normal units, but they're going to work very well for drill men. So that'll also help a lot if you use one of those drill boosters on Endless and you use upgrade Titan Drill Dragon. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, yeah. Hold I didn't on. Ask yeah. Telephone pole boy. Yeah. Yeah. Just let me go ahead and equip my upgraded Titan. Dr yeah. Let me just go ahead and up. No one, ha no one has that, dude. But I'm pretty sure cool hail will be adding this to the upcoming update he might have already added it and fixed it but we're going to make upgraded titan drill dragons barriers a lot smaller when placing him so you're going to be able to place a lot more on the map especially Oh, yeah. If you guys haven't seen that, what he's talking about... Here, let me show you. I'm sure a good amount of you have actually experimented with this and do know what he's talking about, but didn't really connect the dots whenever he said it. Uh, but for people that have, like, rolled the dice and gotten the upgraded Titan Drill Dragon inside of Ohio mode... I didn't have any units equipped. I'm an idiot. Uh, he took up so much space. Like, he is ridiculously hard to place because his barrier took up like so much space is what he's saying so they're gonna make it smaller so you can place it closer together like how some units you can't place close together but other ones you can his was like obscenely massive for like no good reason especially on endless mode because we're going to remove his head his wings and his tail from the hitbox so so wait, he's gonna tail whip other units? Yo, dude, you're gonna be on the field and the Titan Drill Dragon is gonna be able to attacking something else and you're gonna hear a 
and turn around, and your camera girl is going to be knocked across the map. Oh, it'll be a lot easier to fit him, because right now, he cannot fit in most locations on the map and is kind of inconvenient to place. Yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. Amen, brother. Anyways, I'm going to show another unit. This is the cheese. <laughs> Excuse me? Excuse What? Why? What? It Why? Drill man. So let me explain this guy. It's actually a, yeah, it's actually an interesting do. story. I think you guys. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I bet it is an interesting story. You better explain this one, buddy. This makes no sense. Wait. 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 I have a guess. I'm guessing. I think he got one of the developers from Cheese TD to help him out with TTD. That's my guess. Watch. They're gonna like it. But but just look at his cheese. He has cheese a hat, and cheese a drill, whiskers like a I'm mouse, sure. and he even has blue cheese. Right. Anyways, I was thinking of a drill booster crate, and I had two ideas for booster units, and both of them are military themed. I'm gonna leave the best one as a secret. I showed you guys the most common one, but I wanted to have one really common one and one really rare one, but I didn't want to just have all. So I like the firework crate. All of them as booster units. Or there's two there's two units you can get. One's like 99.9, the other one's 0 0.1. Cause that'd be like a booster only crate. So it'd be a little boring. So I was thinking, what can I add? So it's not booster only. To make this crate interesting, a unique and new drill unit that will improve the quality of the drill event. And I have decided on the cheese drill, man. So he's gonna be great. I think everyone's gonna like it. It'll be it'll be definitely worth grinding for. Creating your so while this ad plays in the background, he didn't explain at all what the cheese guy did. Or, like, I guess he explained the story of how he got it, but it still doesn't make sense how he got to cheese. Either way, I will keep watching. It's gonna be a pretty decent slowing unit, the blue cheese. Okay, okay, he's explaining it now. Slowing unit, so he's gonna throw cheese at units. I like it, Picasso. Cheese is blue because it slows toilets, and after literally months, almost a year of VIP being almost... Almost useless. I mean, we made it. Whoa! Wait! Wait! Is it happening, guys? Is it happening? Slightly more useful in the drill event. You can claim a hundred drills and a random drill boost in the VIP rewards area. I'd say that's kind of worth it. And then also in the normal world. Well, Wait. let's go back there first. Every four hours, you tell can me. claim twenty gems and a boost. Which I mean, to be honest, I think it's worth it because if you shut are up, no, you do no, you do get out. Get out! He is so full of it. No, 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 no. Hey, Teapot, Telephone Boy, Boy. Hey, we've been on good terms recently. I just got hacked. Either way, um, dude, you are lying. You're lying. You're making excuses, and you know it. Buy gems. Like twenty gems is pretty much almost twenty robux. So if you claim it for enough days, it ends up being worth it. But it's still not just that good, especially considering you can just. Okay. Oh, sorry. He. We agree then. Sorry. My bad. Go to quests and get twenty-five gems. Okay, but that's not VIP dude here for free four times a week and then you get an extra 50 and then five times three times a day plus 10 so vip just yeah he's laughing because he knows that there's units that cost 500 quantillion dingleberries to buy here let me go over to the shop teapot at that yeah so here let me do all of this over the course for a week and get 400 gems let's see what great unit I could possibly buy Mr. Telephone Pool. Who says it's worth it? He says, yo, it's so it's so worth it. You gotta do it. Which I didn't do on my free-to-play versus pay-to-win account. Keep in mind, let's go ahead. Yeah, let's... Oh, yeah, I want a gadget crate. It's 30k. It's just, a, it's just a quick 30k. I want a Sigma crate. Oh, you want to grind for a Sigma crate? Oh, I could just go grind Ohio mode. 15 minutes and get one. I want a fan crate? No, nah, can't get it. Go ahead and play this game consistently every day for three weeks, and then maybe you can sniff it. Oh, you oh, okay, You want a little future crate? Oh, future crate? Okay, yeah, play the game for three months, and then maybe you can get it. You guys see the problem here, right? Like... Like we're on this, we're on the same page. I'm glad we're on the same page. Really isn't worth it. A lot of people have been saying that it's bad and that we need to add something Me. to it. So Me. we're adding a little bit of stuff to VIP. It's happening! It's not gonna be nearly the main focus of the update though. Just a small change so that it's not so bad anymore. I just want to say the VIP camera. It's finally happening! I've been asking for this for two months. 
too much. I've waited so. You know how long I've waited for this? I'm about to make that name for myself. Our man is involved, and look at how cool he looks. He, he has cool. money symbols by him. This he is has this is how I imagine I am Evan looks. By the way, stacks of that's a comp. Evan, if you're watching, that's a compliment. Cash behind them, and he has a really cool watch. And I just remembered something. I'll tell you guys a fun fact. So uh, you guys probably. You know what Rolexes are, the super expensive watch brand. Anyways, I thought Rolex was a Roblox thing because when I used to trade a lot on Roblox, I'd always see it. Well, sometimes I see people talk. Uh, is, is, is he just. Is there anything else about the, the update or.? have a decent amount of units the modeler is taking a bit of time to make everything though so we're gonna have the rest of the units because right now there is still well there's only one more unit and one more crate that still needs to be modeled but i mean today well today is the day before friday and friday is the day before the update so that's really gonna be one day for all the animations for those things and the vfx and for that unit to be scripted but luckily Luckily, Cam has been locking in. Cam is pool hail, by the way. I, I, I call him each thing sometimes just because, I mean... Is there anything else about the update? Everything does go smoothly, this update, and we don't have a ton of bugs or something weird. Oh, yeah, I hope we don't have a bunch of bugs or something weird like that. Yeah, every update recently has been bugged. Every single one. But I will say, there is something else very, very, very cool in this update. In my opinion, possibly even cooler than the Drill Event Part 2 update that we're at. Yeah, it's VIP rewards. Adding. And I have not said a single thing about it so far. So I think you guys are really going to like that. That's the big surprise. You guys will find out when the update comes out. But we're adding something really, really, really cool that a lot of people have wanted for a long time. Hold on, I'm about to pee my pants, but we need to theorize what this is. So people have been begging for this for a long time. I'm one of the people that's always begging. I think I'm going to snipe this. So my guess is something that people have been begging for for a long time my guess is it's either gonna be pvp mode or the uts titan cinema man and uttv reworked is gonna happen that that's the only way that that's like the only thing that i think it could possibly be let me know what you guys think what the heck and just in case you guys are like don't think it's true or confused or concerned about it this is on the TTD feature request page. As you can literally see, this is in the plan category. So these things have been planned for however long it is. And PvP, Drill Event, and the UTS, these all have the most upvotes, which means people want them the bows. They want them badly. With that being said, with, oh, what the flip? With that being said, I think it's going to be one of those. I, I think I think it is. I talked about it a little bit a while ago and almost 3.3 million people wanted that big thing. I'm gonna leave that big surprise a secret. With that number, you guys may be able to guess what it is. So good luck. But as always, like, subscribe. 3.13 million? Hold on, did they do a community post forever ago? Hmm, I don't see any community posts, but 3.1 million people wanted it. This is fun. Detective Hopeless is on the case. If I come up with anything, I would surely let you know. Either way... Uh, this update, surprisingly, as little as I've heard about it, I actually wasn't expecting an update at all. Uh, it looks like it's gonna be pretty jam-packed, so I think we have a lot to look forward to. Uh, this does get the stamp of approval for me. This does go under the cook category. I did say if I was gonna say if it was cooked or not cooked at the end of the video. But I would say it's very, very good. Let me know your guys' thoughts down below. And as T-Phone Telpone Boy said, that guy, like and subscribe. I love you guys. And I might make a new channel. If I do, subscribe. Bye!